have to have Lucifer and Ariman, we have to take the gifts that they bring. Yeah, those hands are not pushing away. No. They are Wait holding. There we go. <laughs> yeah, she's got one Lucifer up, one down. Lucifer in his place, exactly. Ariman in his place. Exactly. As Serving. the representative strides forward, as Sherry said exactly. this morning. Exactly. It's not static, it's not passive. No. It's not a sort of giving over to nothingness. It is a moving forward in inner yeah. activity. Yeah. And that's also what these arts, the ones that are imbued with this picture of the whole human being, are aiming for a certain transparency mm -hmm. to, to bring all the bodies along so that the bodies become, and therefore the, the forces that work with them, in service mm -hmm. of the ego that is doing the directing. Yeah. So it is not the astral, um, psychological place that is driving in a sort of instinctual, unconscious mm -hmm. way, yeah. which with some, and perhaps many exceptions, is kind of the norm of mm -hmm. what people think of as drama. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's not hugely physical either, it's a, it's a permeating of all of those movement bodies and physical body and emotional body feeling life so that the true I can be the one who is doing the directing. Yeah. And then that's where we join and that's where the arts can actually come to life. Yeah, I always say, you know, do what you do during the day and at night those angels connect it all. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> it, it, is, it is wonderful, fun, exciting, fascinating work. Yeah. Um, and it does create a lot of movement. Yeah. And all of that comes through a lot of pain, too. Oh, yes. 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 Well, you know, like, like, like uh, Sherry said this morning, you know, you have self -knowledge to. Self-knowledge comes from facing. Well, the the pain, the pain, the pain push, pushes you in the right direction. Mm -hmm. You know. If you um, go there, and that's yeah. at his abyss. And if and if you if you don't if you don't go into that, then you're going to have pain for a long time. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Until yeah. you get the message or something, you know. Yeah. Pain is not. <laughs> it's not. To be avoided. It's, no. It's our birthright. It should claim it. There and you teacher. go. Yeah. yeah. There you go. We, yeah. we, 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 why, why give up one of our greatest gifts? You can if you wanted to. Why always, would you try? I, I, always, I always say to, to me, I mean, pain has something to do with the astral body cramping. I mean, mm. you know, uh, the astral body is in a place uh, too, too strongly, whatever. Mm. Contraction. Yeah. Okay. I mean, if, if I have a pain somewhere, oh, that's a contraction. And, and can... part of what these arts do, I was reminded by a, a friend who has worked with, gone through the whole spatial dynamics training as I am going through it now. Mm -hmm. So we were talking about the, the gifts of spatial dynamics, which works with movement mm -hmm. and this mm -hmm. directing of the ego of the etheric mm -hmm. and all of the health giving properties that that brings. And we came to this same thing, you know, when we experience ourselves in pain of our inner lives in whatever form. The way she put this was something like, yes, that's going to happen because we are human beings. You know, we experience anger or fear or grief. The thing is, the etheric life force body does not have to follow the same form of contraction no. that the astral body is taking. Exactly. Because we learn what we learn through eurythmia and through spatial dynamics and through speech formation and mm -hmm. through the Chekhov work, mm. we can exert our power of will to do something else. Yeah. And That's... bring ourselves and the... in, into a healthy relationship that will... E uh, that will that will invite then the astral body to in its time breathe into those forms mm -hmm. which we are creating mm -hmm. and the power of will is not dogged 
effort. No. It's no. not straining. <laughs> if I was holding the camera with that dogged effort, my arm would fall off. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I'm holding the camera for hours sometimes. Yes. You know, I mean, it, it never lacks into it. And, and that's why I say contraction, when, when you talk about all the feelings, to me, contraction and expansion, there's nothing else. Either you have a contraction or you have an expansion. And which Both of them is hurt. Doing Both of them hurt. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Both of them hurt. And that's where Steiner's exercises come in with openness yes. and with equanimity yes. and positivity yes. and whatever else. I mean, to me, I'm the master. Yes. I can say, I'm not going to feel this. I mean, I'm not pushing it away or anything like that. I'm going to go into it and whatever it is and say, okay, thank you very much. You You're know? not be bound by it. Well, yeah, I mean, we, you know, I mean, when we're dead, we won't have this body that contracts. So, <laughs> Right, or even the life force body that contracts, exactly. or even Anything. the soul body that contracts. No, no. So we better all feel it here. <laughs> That's right. Anyways, I thank you both. Thank you. This has been wonderful. Thank and you, I'm Mariana. sure, I mean, uh, actually call me Marianne because I, I was that sort of a long time Another ago. Another life. <laughs> yeah, more, more than 50 years ago. So, yeah. Thank but, you, Marianne. Yeah, yeah right. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, the rest of the world should know about this. Thank All you right. for doing this. Yeah, thank, doing you for, thank you for doing this. Good deed. <laughs>